Okay, this video is gonna be for all the young ones that don't know how to make collard greens. Beyonce even talked about them. I mean, come on, you gotta learn. Um, <laughs> we got the coffee pot going because I soak my greens in vinegar. You can use baking soda, vinegar. It removes the pesticides, okay? Um, I've got my onions over here. I'm already ready to cut them babies up. But you want to look when you're in the grocery store. Like some of you guys do not know how to do anything other than a can. Like seriously. Alright. Collard greens. It's on the label. Okay. And you're going to soak these for about 10 minutes in either baking soda or vinegar. Alright. I use vinegar. It removes pesticides. It uh, takes all that good stuff out that you don't need. Okay. It's good in the field. It's not good in your body. All right. Um, and you can see here, it tells you where it comes from. And then turnip greens, okay? So we got collard green, turnip greens, and these are mustard. And plain mustard, okay? Now, to season this, basically all you're going to do is cut this up after you soak it and rinse it really good. Um, you're going to cut it up and put it in a pot, and you're going to season it. And my choice is smoked pork hocks, okay? Uh, I call them ham hocks. You can use the Thanksgiving turkey um, or the ham. You can use the meat from that for juice. Bacon, even, okay? Uh, people use turkey necks. They use ham hocks. They use uh, bacon. Any kind of salted pork, pork, okay? But I just wanted to show you how you do your greens. Because apparently nobody knows how to do it unless they're in a can. Nowadays. So, I've already got my black-eyed peas going. I got the ham hocks, some bacon... And the black-eyed peas in there. My cabbage is already going. And I'm ready to start with the pork chops. <laughs> That's just a lesson for you. All you youngins that want to know. And please soak your produce because there's all kinds of chemicals and pesticides that cause cancer and everything else. And it only takes a little while to soak it in some white vinegar. Or some baking soda and rinse it really really good have a good day happy new year